Hi, I'm Paul Drew from Studio One Expert. Today I'm going to show you the fantastic new comping features in Studio One 3.2. Now we've been lucky at Studio One Expert by getting uh, a pre-release copy of, of Studio One 3.2 and we've all got to say it's blown us away. Most of the features that most of us have missed from being ex Pro Tool users have been addressed here. So it's really catering for the ex Pro Tools user that's come over from Pro Tools into Studio One. So today I'm going to be looking at the comping features. So I've recorded a vocal here. Now let's open up the layers here by expanding the layers. I'm going to show you all the features here. So the first thing that you'll notice is this new icon here that we're given for, uh, for, for comping. So let me just choose a load of different takes for my comp. And you'll see all of the colors have appeared as well. Because we can actually change the colors here on our, um, on our takes. So let me just change that, say, to red. And this one here to, I don't know, white, for instance. We're going to scroll that back over there. Now, we've also got the opportunity to go through the different takes. So if I hold down my Alt or Option key, and I use the G and the H keys, I can scroll through my different takes here. And again, choose this part. Until I'm completely happy with my take. We've also got this option here as well. If I just choose my range tool and I select a part of a take, I can hold down Alt and V and promote up to my master take. But for me, to be honest, using the new smart tool, I think it's much quicker just to select whatever I want. The next thing that I'm going to show you is if I open up my wrench tool up here and I choose solo follow selection and I can solo my take here and I can play my different takes. I looked it up to find the meaning by using the up and down arrows. Somebody that you don't know so why is it that you're still feeling? And again, I can select the item that I want, Alt V, and promote it up to the master track. Okay, the next thing that I'm going to show you, if I highlight my track here and I click G, I've now grouped all these events. I can still, I can still choose the different parts of the takes that I want to promote. And as you can see, the colors are still changing on my group track. So I'm sure you'll agree that the new comping features in 3.2 are fantastic and a great improvement on an already great system. Make sure you check out the other videos that uh, Marcus and Russ and the other guys are doing as well on the 3.2 features. And I'm Paul from Studio One Expert. I'll see you next time.